the successful man will profit from his mistakes and try again in a different way. Dale Carnegie. Hello, my name is Breon Mills, and I would like to welcome you back to this ongoing training on candlesticks. Today, we will be discussing part six, the Harami candlestick. Now, the Harami candlestick is a pattern that's comprised of two candles, which indicates a potential reversal or continuation in the market. The Harami candlestick pattern can signal both bullish and bearish indications. All right, you have the bullish Harami and you have the bearish Harami. Let's take a look at the bullish Harami. Now, in order for uh, this to be considered a bullish Harami pattern, it must be at the bottom of a downtrend. All right. Now, the leading candle must be a large red candle or what we call a large bearish candle. And the following candle, the trailing candle, must be a small bullish green candle. Now, the price gaps up after the bearish candle and is contained within the open and the close of the large leading red bearish candle. All right. But again, the following candle after the bullish Arami must be trading above the high of the bearish candle. OK, so let's take a look now. After seeing what you just saw. <laughs> Take a moment and try to identify a Harami bullish candlestick. All right, now if this is the candlestick pattern that you identified. You are well on your way to becoming a phenomenal trader. All right, so. There you have the bullish Arami. And remember, in order for us to jump into this trade, there must be confirmation. And our confirmation is the following candle must be trading above the bearish red candle. And so this ca this candlestick here is trading above the candle. So we make our entry and hopefully we profitize from this entry. All right. Now, let's take a look at the bearish Harami. Now, in order for the bearish Harami to be effectively traded, it must be at the top of an uptrend. The leading candle must be a large bullish candle or large green candle. And the trailing candle must be a small red or small bearish candle. All right. Now the price gaps down after the bullish candle and is contained within the open and close of the leading bullish candle. All right. Now let's take a look at this chart here. Take a moment to see if you can identify a bearish Harami candlestick pattern. Now, if this is the pattern that you recognize, you are well on your way to becoming a remarkable trader. So we have the bearish of Rami pattern. We have the large green candle followed by a small red candle within the parameters of the green candle. Next, we have confirmation. We do have the candle that's trading below the 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 bullish candle so we make our entries here and hopefully profitize from this or this could signal for us an opportunity to get out of a trade if we've already made a profit all right and there you have it this is easy easy stuff right again let's summarize the harami candle it's easy to identify and there's a great opportunity to capitalize on large movements with high risk high reward ratios and it requires confirmation before execution. Remember, do not jump in this trade if the candlestick following the Harami 
It's not trading above the bullish Harami candlestick pattern or below the bearish Harami candlestick pattern. And there you have it. All right. Now, thanks for watching. And now, if this is your first time, make sure you hit the like, subscribe button, and come on back for more of this wealth building information. Peace.